over how to use the Lead Phone One Chrome extension. So the Chrome extension, it does have to be used with the Chrome browser. So as long as you have the Chrome browser, um, the first thing I would recommend is logging into your account. Once you're logged in, this is the dashboard that you'll normally see. To download the Chrome extension, it's gonna be the Chrome icon right on the header. So once you connect that, add to Chrome, add extension, it's gonna bring you right to the payment page. Um, that just lets you know that you're logged in, Chrome extension's been added. So where this Chrome extension will be valuable is if you're looking um, maybe at a profile on here. So let me go ahead and pull up a quick list. If you're looking at some profiles on here and you just wanna verify maybe that this person still says they work for the company um, and you wanna go check out their LinkedIn profile. So here I'll pop open a couple of these contacts. So when you get to a LinkedIn profile, the Chrome extension will sit on the right hand side. So with Michael Groner here, I'm a third connection of his. If I click see contact info, I can't see any email addresses or phone numbers, but that's what our Chrome extension will do is show you what do we have on Michael inside of Lead Phone One. So we have his verified email shown right up here on the Chrome extension. If we have a direct dial, um, that will populate in here as well. So you're at least able to see any of that person or company information just by being on their profile. So if he is the best person to speak with, or if you wanna to move to maybe the director of IT at the company, this is where you can kind of click on other contacts. And if we don't have Jeff in the database, or if he's going under Jeffrey, we still have the option where we can research and get his email as a best guess, or it will verify right here on the fly. Um, so that's how you'll use it with LinkedIn profiles. Um, that will be a good way to explain it. The other option is at company websites. So some of these companies like um, Centini Corporation, that's what we have them on our Centini Corporation. But if this company was using an acronym name or you know, maybe they are, have a different name doing business as, so this is where you can go right to a company website where just by being on the website, the Chrome extension will know what we have that company under because we're reading the URL. And then from here, you can just click on the company and open up the company profile inside of Lead Phone One. So that's just an easy way to get right in there, see all the employees, um, you know, do any searching that you want. You can also just by being on here, if you know someone's name, this is where we can type in you know, a specific name and say, find me all the Ryans that we have in Lead Phone One's database for this company. And then it will start populating that information. Um, same thing, we can do this for title. So if we want to find anybody that has marketing in their title at this company, we can put in a title and then it will populate those people that match the marketing titles. Um, so that will be kind of the main uses of utilizing the tool. Um, when you do have these people pulled up, you can export them by adding them to the shopping cart or pushing them to your CRM system. So that's, again, just where we're trying to save you some time so you don't have to copy and paste the person or manually enter them into your CRM. We can do it in one click when we're integrated with you. Um, perfect. So let us know at leadphone1.com if you do have any other additional questions.